This is just a short explainer video for the Fluid Dynamics Housetron Catalytic Anti-Scale Water Treatment. What we're doing with the Housetron is conditioning water and preventing scale. We're not softening water. So from a visual perspective, the Housetron looks just like a piece of pipe, more commonly known in the industry as a nipple. We've got male pipe thread on both ends, and the Housetron is directional. So the flow direction is indicated by an arrow on the label. Just a little bit about how the house tron works. Nothing is added to the water. Nothing is taken away from the water. All we are doing is treating the calcium. This is an analogy that I like to use. The house tron is a catalytic converter for your calcium in water. So the catalytic process happens when water flows over the core that's inside the house tron at the right flow rate. When that happens, the calcium and the carbon that's in the water reacts with the metal that's in the core, and the calcium is transformed. Now naturally, when water flows through your system and out of your faucets or into your water heater, calcium falls out as calcite. Untreated, calcite falls out and looks like this up here. It's very jagged and sticky, and it sticks to itself and fixtures and faucets and other minerals and builds up layer upon layer. That's where you get scale from. Once the catalytic process, or in chemistry, a catalyst makes something happen before it naturally would, so we're actually precipitating the calcium as aragonite calcium. You can see in this magnification that aragonite calcium is smooth, and it doesn't have any reason to stick to itself or anything else that's in your system. So we get to leave the beneficial minerals in the water, but it will pass right through your system. And that is the Fluid Dynamics House Tron. On the pages you're looking at, you're going to see sizes. Typically, most homes, 95% of the time, will take a half inch house tron, which is one half inch by 10 inches long. Check the links at the bottom of this video or the page you're on for more information.